Ever wondered what goes on inside your speaker when you play your favorite songs? Let's find out. First off, we have the main control panel. This is what lets you crank up your favorite tunes during those wild house parties. This is a speaker grill which protects the drivers underneath. This is the diffuser panel. It evenly distributes lights from the LEDs across the speaker. This here is the LED panel of the speaker. It's the source of the cool RGB lights you see on it. This is where the speaker emits sounds from, the woofer and the tweeter. This is the woofer of the speaker which is used for low frequency sounds such as the bass and vocals in a song. The tweeter here is used for high frequency sound, what one calls treble. Speakers generally emit sound in two forms, positive and negative punch. Positive punch refers to the sound directed outwards from the front of the speaker and negative punch refers to the sound which is deflected to the back of the speaker. Here are the battery pack and main board, the heart and brain of the speaker. The motherboard of the speaker has all input and output ports as well as the Bluetooth antenna and amplifier IC on it. This here is the amplifier IC. The actual output of a 30 watt speaker like this is close to 1 watt. The amplifier IC is what boosts this output to 30 watts. This is the power supply port of the speaker which is what delivers power to the battery pack. Here are the various input and output ports of the speaker. There's a USB Type-C port for charging, a USB port for pen drives, an aux port for connecting your phone to the device via an aux cable, and a microphone input should you happen to like karaoke. This is the reflector panel which directs all sound towards the front of the speaker. This is your speaker broken down. Let's build it up. And that's it. Subscribe to Unbox by Chroma for more such deep dives into everyday tech.